Can I just say that was not a pretty sight? <laughs> wow. Wow. I swear I'm like Dolly Parton's sister. <laughs> Oh my God, that was so bad. <laughs> but for all of you new people that don't know, <laughs> when I first started my channel, go back to the very beginning and watch some of my videos from when I started five years ago. God, it's been five years already. Whenever something exciting happens in my life, I would do a happy dance and I would do it out there. But that was 30 pounds ago. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of shaking going on. <laughs> I'm sure my OGs there got quite the kick out of that. <laughs> wow. Okay, so I got some good news. Oh, man. Okay, so I see in the titles. One banana, two banana, three banana, four. <laughs> uh, my oldest daughter is banana one. My youngest daughter is banana two. My grandson, Axel, is banana three. Guess what? <laughs> my oldest is Ashley. Woo! <laughs> Let me tell you, I cried. I was sitting at work and she sent me the sonogram picture and I was crying. I had, I had to cl close my shop. I, <laughs> I was a mess. I was a mess, you guys. Oh my God. Um, here's the sonogram. <laughs> we got baby number two. On the way. Oh, baby number three, actually, because my niece had her baby four months after my youngest daughter had hers. So, we, yeah. Holy cow. Um, let me just say this. I never in a million years thought that my oldest daughter was going to give me a grandchild. Whew. <laughs> yeah, um, I just reserved, I, I, I reserved, reserved? No, I, I accepted, um, that I was probably going to never have, have one from Ashley, um, because she was with, um, a woman before. Now... She is with a fellow named Noah, and I've met him twice, I think. Uh, I haven't really met him, met him. I've, I've kind of met him just to see him and say hello. Uh, we haven't actually had any conversations or anything yet. Um, she's been with him for two years or something. Um... So I, from what I understand, um, he's a wonderful guy and he's very excited about this child. Um, I think it's become a reality for Ashley now. Uh, before, I mean, she, she had, ter she's got terrible morning sickness. Um, they've got her on medication for that. And I'm really hoping that she doesn't have what I had. It's a big, long word. I'll put it right here. Um, <clears throat> back then, 32, 33 years ago. No. Yeah. Um, they did, they never named it. Uh, so I had no idea. I should have been hospitalized. I was, I was sick for eight months of my pregnancy. It wasn't until the last month and she, she was induced two weeks early, as was Tia. Um, but I, 
I couldn't keep anything down for eight months. So they were really concerned that, um, that she was going to be extremely small and that we, we were going to have complications. <clears throat> oh, no, 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 we did not. <laughs> I mean, there, there were some complications in the sense that she didn't want to come out. She knew that she had two more weeks in there and she didn't want to come out, but she put my hips out. I was in a lot of pain and we were like, no, you're getting out. Um, so she ended up, you know, swallowing some amniotic fluid and her temperature dropped and they put her in an incubator. So, but other than that, she was fine. She actually came out over five pounds. So, or six pounds. Oh, one of them was, I think it was both around six pounds. Um, so she was a healthy weight. And when she was born, they said, you know, where did you keep her? Because I didn't gain all that much weight. I was all baby and my stomach wasn't huge. So, uh, I came out of it anorexic and, uh, cause she just, she fed off me. Right. So, um, I, I, and I was really sick. I was really, really sick. And I was, as, I was thin like Ashley. So to begin with, so yeah, uh, I'm praying that Ashley's gonna not have to deal with that. Because I didn't have medications. I wasn't on an IV or anything. She's already got the medications. She's been to the hospital. She got an IV. And um, they're going to switch her medication, apparently. So I'm really hoping that it's going to help. Um, excuse me. Michelle, my niece, she was really sick through her pregnancy, too. But she had other issues going on. Tia, on the other hand, she was sick for a little bit. And then she was good. I was so jealous. <laughs> so we're really hoping that um, Ashley isn't going to suffer too much. Once her first trimester's over, she should be okay. She's already eating stuff that I could never eat, right? Like she sent me a picture, like she had pasta and stuff. And I was just like, wow, like you're way ahead of what I was. So I think she's going to be fine. Uh, with Tia, on the other hand, I, I was sick for maybe a week and then I was good and I ate for probably three people <laughs> and I never lost the weight. So <clears throat> yeah, I've definitely made up for the first time round, <laughs> but I am, I, I was in absolute shock. Um, she was on the phone with my niece and that was when my car was in the shop and my niece had to drive me to work. She had just picked me up and she was on the phone with Ashley and Ashley told Michelle and she said, Michelle said, do you want to tell your mom? She's in the car with me. <laughs> and she's like, Oh, sure. <laughs> so that's how I found out. And, um, my jaw was on the ground for probably three days. Uh, I, 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 yeah, I was just, I was on a whole different level. I didn't know what to think at first. Um, and then all of a sudden it just kind of kicked in and I was like, holy crap, I'm going to be a grandma again. I'm, I'm still trying to get used to the first one. So, <laughs> uh, and then when she sent me the sonogram yesterday, I, then it really hit me. And then I was over the fricking moon. Um, I'm hoping for a girl. She's hoping for a boy. Uh, I, I don't know. I'd like to have a girl for selfish reasons. Um, because I want to crochet dresses. <laughs> is, is that really selfish of me? I want her to have a whole bunch of different dresses. <laughs> so, I want to, I want to do baby clothes, you know, like, I got to do Axel and, and Mason's sweater and a blanket, but that's about it. You know, like I, I really wanted to, I want to do dresses and stuff. So I'm kind of hoping, uh, but you know, it is what it is. I will love that child no matter what it is. Right. Like I, mm -mm, whatever, as long as it's happy and healthy, I'm good. You know, so can you imagine three boys in the family? 
Blah. Oh my God. <laughs> so anyway. Um, yeah. So ta -da! here we go again. Here we go. So it's, it's going to be, and get this. It might be a December baby like Axel. And if not, then it'll end up being the first week of January. So it's going to be Axel's birthday, Christmas, this baby's birthday, and then four months later, Mason's birthday. <sighs> holy crap. <laughs> it just, holy crap. <laughs> oh man, it's going to be a wild ride. Wild ride. So I don't know if she's going to want to know what it is. She's probably going to want to find out if it's a boy or a girl, I'm sure. Um, but yeah, uh, I'll let you guys know when I find out. So I'm, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. And, uh, God, this is crazy. It's absolutely crazy. So anyways, I just wanted to share it with you guys. And, uh, yeah. Hey, Angela, Sandy. I need another baby blanket. <laughs> Just saying. Hint, hint, hint. <laughs> um, and my friend Angela and my bestie Sandy Duda from Left is Right Crochet and uh, Angela from My Precious Narnery. They both uh, made baby blankets and, and stuff. Uh, Angela made um, uh, baby face cloths and stuff like that too. And uh, sent them out to Tia. So, yeah, it was. <laughs> oh, it's going to be crazy. Um, so anyways, yeah, I there's a I've got the crib right here, too. And I kept saying to myself, you know, I got to sell this crib or do something with it. And just as I was about to do it. Boom. Another baby. <laughs> so I think I'm going to hold on to it. <laughs> A little bit longer but yeah so anyway okay you guys i love you all <laughs> yike <laughs> pray for me <laughs> all right i will talk to you guys later i love you all bye <laughs>